cancer. We immediately associate this word with the loss of a loved one, a friend, or a teacher. Instead of having this anxiety, we should be aware that there are numerous treatment options available to conquer cancer. Proton therapy is one of the most precise and effective technique. Hi, I'm Surikan Koshi. I'm an early stage researcher in Raptor Consortium and my host institute is Research Laboratories where we are fighting cancer with code. I'm also a PhD student at Medical Radiation Physics Division in Stockholm University. I'm working on robust optimization techniques considering uncertainties in online adaptive proton therapy. My role at Raptor is to quantify the uncertainties and clinically validate the improved automated plan optimization techniques. Intensity modulated proton therapy known as IMPT offers some distinct advantages. However, the delivery complexities increases the uncertainties. This is especially concerning because some of the anatomical changes like patient weight loss can occur during the radiation treatment time of several months to weeks and some changes can occur within the day. An uncertainty specific to online adaptive treatments in this context is associated with the correction of CDCT images. These images are acquired for visualization of patient anatomy during the treatment setup. We are developing a CBCT correction method to generate an anatomy preserved virtual CT which can mitigate the drawbacks of the presently available methods. The radiological factors which describe the response of the tissue to radiation have a major factor of uncertainty in proton therapy. Presently, a constant value of 1.1 is considered as relative biological effectiveness known as RBE for protons. Various models are available for variable RBE which we will incorporate into the adaptive workflow and analyze the uncertainties. Not only we just quote, we investigate the clinical implication of all newly developed techniques through comparative treatment planning studies. Right now I am at Oncore which is a university clinic in Germany and I am working on implementing the variable RB models on the patient data. The collective efforts by Raptor with early stage researchers will surely bring the scientific advancement faster in adaptive particle therapy. So, let's all join this fight and kiss the cancer good boy.